So I just watched Gents Sense to keep four fragrances for life. And it really got me thinking, hmm, maybe I should create my own four fragrances for each one for each season. And then he just universally tagged everybody. So I was like, sweet, I'm so doing this. So here is my four fragrances to keep for life season version. First season, I'm gonna just do some old and winter spring because that's just the way I load seasons is Allure Home Sport O Extreme. I love, it's like the creamy orange smell. And it's, I mean, the way that I pick these fragrances is all about how, um, how well they project, how their longevity is, and how, I guess, not so much versatile, they're not all versatile. In fact, some of them aren't very versatile at all. But this one is, I'd probably say, the most versatile of the four seasons. It's summer, it's when it's hot, and heat is just one of those things you know, I'm, personally I'm always going to encounter because I travel to uh, Asia and Australia. And Australia gets hot, and Asia's always hot. So this one's coming with me. Next, summer autumn. I'm going to go for Sauvage EDT. I recently um, tested EDP after purchasing one back in Australia, and the reason I purchased it because I thought it was better than EDT, and people were saying, oh, but you missed this whole Bergamot at the beginning part, and that was the first thing I noticed this time around testing it, the lack of that, I mean, it's just like a really, it's like the announcement of the fragrance, and it was missing, and I was like, holy shit, I actually really like that part of it. So for Autumn, Sauvage. Next is Winter, and I'm gonna have to go with Armani Code Parfumo. What does it smell like? I have no idea, but I spent a lot of time testing all the different fragrances in the department store, and this is the one that I like the most. Unfortunately, I mean, you, you could actually use this in summer, I use this in summer, but it's better suited for winter, and it is very, very long lasting. So, that's a solid pick. And last would be spring. Now, spring is when the plants are blossoming and they're bearing fruit. So I have to go with Ultramol, which smells like pear. I mean, it's a bit of a stretch thinking that it smells like pear, but compared to Eros, which is a bit of a stretch saying it smells like apple, I mean, it's solid. It is, I mean, look how little I've used. They come in such big bottles too, you get 25% extra. And if you can get it, it is so cheap. You can just spray so much of this, and I mean, Jeremy Fragrance did like a, um, a most complimented list, and it, if you, like one, one time I sprayed it in the girl's hand, and initially, initially, uh, initially she was like, mm, no, I don't like this. But then after five to ten minutes, she was like, oh, I really like this. So, this one here. I think this would, I'd happily take this for the rest of my life with me. So thanks for uh, for tagging me, Mr. Jensense. Hopefully you get a chance to watch my very amateuristic video. And until next time.